States. This video has been circulating on social media showing a Utah high school student cutting down a pride flag and students cheering him on. Bob, today parents rallied at Ridgeline High School to show their support to those in the LGBTQ community. Fox 13's Aaron Cox spoke to parents and students today and joins us now live. Aaron. Yeah, Bob and Kelly, there's a few things to understand with context here. The pride flag was put up with flags from across the world, countries across the world, as a part of the students' diversity week. And those students say the person who tore down the pride flag was not hateful, it was still hurtful. Looking from the outside, some people make judgments. I'm part of the LGBT community. That's what Sid Seeholzer, a senior at Ridgeline High School, has experienced for herself. People like to belittle the LGBT community. And it's something Sid wants to make sure doesn't happen to the student caught on camera cutting down a pride flag. I don't think that it was a thinking moment. No! He called me and apologized to me. He. I think it was a personality lapse. The pride flag was hanging in front of the Cuban flag, among other countries of the world, for Diversity Week at Ridgeline. Whenever I go into a, like, a place and I see a rainbow flag or something waving, I feel safer. Watching that safety symbol cut down. It's racist. It was mostly just a feeling of a little bit of panic. Woo. A feeling shared by those in the community. As someone that went to high school here, I thought it was important to come out and show that you can be whoever you want to be and stay in the valley and grow up and have a happy life here. A sidewalk full of support. Any kid at Ridgeline that felt alone yesterday to know that you have an army of support from people you don't know who love you and and we'll be there showing up for you today um, just to say we love you. Looking from the outside, people may have seen a protest, but really, <laughs> it's a sight of friends. And they've been reaching out to me and asked me what they can do to help. Well, the Cache County School District did release a statement saying they do not condone the cutting down of this flag, which was done without their permission. They say this type of incident reminds us of the importance of continually educating students, not just during a diversity week. Live from Cache Valley, Utah, Aaron Cox, Fox 13 News. Utah.